system has cut back on different arts um, so hopefully we're uh, providing something that's missing in the schools or in the homes and that is uh, the visual arts the dancing the language arts uh, and certainly on this side of uh, Fort Lauderdale I don't think there's anything quite like us on this side so hopefully we're fulfilling this area and uh, well, hopefully Broward County as a whole. Well, I, I've always been, uh, arts have always been a part of my life, like just like these kids. I started very young and that gives me, that gives me more, a lot of experience because I, I know what's fun and I know what the kids are going to enjoy doing um, because I enjoy doing it myself and when they're, when I'm passionate about doing something the kids can see that and I make it very fun and they really enjoy it. I won't be able to race them all the, all the way because I made it too dark. Right? And I jumped on the back of the monster and lay swimming in the water. So she gets her rower, she gets her lasso out and she, are you drawing some? basic natural expressions anyway that that children that all children have to, to use art and music and dance and all the creative arts and um, um, but especially today unfortunately in the school system they've just cut back on all those important subjects and and stressing the the math and the science and and these things but but it children use their creative expression to learn. It's really, it's intertwined with their whole growth process and coming to understand themselves and relating, you know, to, uh, to other children and getting along with other children. I think that it's the, it's the art where they're, you know, they're actually using themselves while they're learning something. And he said, well, I wouldn't go in there. But, and I said, no. And, and she said, me either. Well, I don't want to go in there because I'm too fat. Oh. 